This video is dedicated to Darren Marion. Love you, brother. Hey, what's going on, guys? In today's video, I'm going to show you why you need to use your picture on your website, in your GMB, and on your social media. Watch this. Hey, what's going on, guys? If you haven't already, please uh, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel if you enjoy this type of content. Now, what I'm going to speak about today is, is the obvious, right? It's a lot of stuff that people know, but if you, if you go back and check your account, I could almost guarantee you're not doing it. What, what is this thing about pictures that, that I'm speaking about in the video that, uh, that you're not doing? Well, let's take it back a step. I'm going to tell you what you are doing. You're buying citations, you're getting backlinks, you're writing articles, you're optimizing your website, you're uh, doing every trick in the book to rank in the Google 3-pack. And then when you finally rank in the Google 3-pack, people are coming to a website with a picture of a car or a picture of a building or a picture of the uh, scales of justice if you're a lawyer. The day, these days are gone where people do business with faceless companies. If you're not going to put your face on your website, on your social media, in your Google My Business, create some videos where you're giving a message to your prospective clients. If they don't get to know you, be prepared to do a lot less business. Now, the clients that I've been getting probably over the past two years have come solely from my YouTube channel. People watch my YouTube channel. They get familiar with me. Some people care for me. Some may not. But the ones that do care for me, they'll go on and they'll go check my um, other videos. They'll check my website. They'll go to my Google My Business. The stats all say that. And then after making up their mind in the privacy of their own home or in their own business, they'll make the decision to contact me and either do a consultation with me or have me work on their website. I guarantee you, those same people, had they just gone to my website without a face, just a picture of uh, SEO, whatever that means, you know, the, uh, the, the picture of, I, I always see uh, on, on SEO's website, it says SEO and then there's an arrow going up. I guarantee if they were to Google SEO, came upon that website and saw that image, they're going to click and go to the next website. People that want to do business with me have already built a relationship with me on YouTube. I don't know them yet, but when I get the opportunity to speak with, uh, with new clients, uh, they will tell me things about myself that I had mentioned in videos that I don't really even remember. And I, I, always, think that's really, I always think that's really nice. But they have built up a relationship with me. And the reason why I'm saying that is that your clients, before they click any contact button, they have to be able to do a couple of things. They have to be able to like you, trust you, and then they'll do business with you. If they don't like and trust you, it's very rare that they're going to do business with you, especially on a big ticket item. So, for example, for DUI law, they're going to ask around for, uh, you know, for, uh, for suggestions and, and, and do some research. Um, however, they're really going to make their decision when uh, they see some proof that you're a great DUI lawyer or you're a, um, a, a, a great um, a auto a car a detailer. For example, they want to see some of your work. They want to see you talking, talking about maybe some of the challenges that you had, some of the things that you that you uh, did on a certain car to bring out the shine. You know, I know very little about car detailing, but I'm just using that as an example today, right? So let's go through a couple of examples. I know it's something very si simple, but you guys have spent thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars 
to get prospective clients to your website only to have them drop off. And the stats say it in regards to the bounce rate. You know, I look at some uh, some stats on some prospective clients that come speak with me and, and, and clients are staying on their, on their website for, you know, 10, 15 seconds, right? Clients need to, uh, prospective clients need to come to your website excited, right? They need to be excited once they get to your website. And then once they get to your website, it's your job to keep them enthused with some good information, right? All right, so let's take a look at this. I'll show you what I mean. So I just put in car detailing because I'm thinking about getting my car detailed. So that's something that's on my mind. And we're going to go to uh, mirror image auto detailing. Now, while I'm showing you this, I want you to think about your site. All right. Isn't this obvious that they, they do car detailing? Isn't it obvious that there would be a sponge and soap? Who's the owner here? Who's the owner of this website about us? I don't see an owner name. I don't know who I could call. Okay, it's a team of perfectionists. Where's the team? Who's the guy? Like, I don't know if this is a real business. You see what I mean? And I'm not getting on this. They've done a great job. They're in the Google three pack. But now that they're there, I personally, me, I'm, I'm just saying that I would move on to another to another site. Now, I've already done some of the research here. So this way, I don't waste your time. All right. So I looked at this website. It's time auto detailing. And when I click, when I click the website, these are the people that I'm going to be doing business with this makes sense. You see, so if I call, I'm going to speak with this young lady or this young man. This is a real business. There's no doubt that this guy is the one that's going to be doing my auto detailing. See that? See the difference? You see the difference? Meanwhile, meanwhile, I could guarantee you that mirror image and and B2 car detailing spent a lot of time and effort to get in the top placement in the Google three pack. And once they're there, people are clicking off and you have a fella here and it's, it's time. They need reviews, right? They need, they need the SEO, <laughs> right? They're the ones that need the SEO, but they're doing the other stuff, right? Their website is correct. Their website is correct. See, to have a picture. So this is what I want you to do. I want you to take a look at your website, take a look at your social, you have a YouTube channel by now, and all you have is a website. I mean, you're really handicapping yourself. This is my website, right? So when you come to the, um, when you come to the, uh, uh, the YouTube channel, you've watched several of my videos and you're like, Hey, let me check out the website. If I had a picture of an SEO with the arrow going up, you'd be like, well, is this the same guy? You're like, okay, yeah, that, that's the same guy. Okay. Yeah. That's the guy. Yeah. All right. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. Right. Then I could tell about my story and my website isn't something so fancy. It's not so great, but you know what? It's familiar and you're able to see that you're able to see that that's the person that was speaking to you on the YouTube channel. And if you go to my YouTube channel, that's me again, right? You know that if you call, I will be the one speaking to you about your SEO. So with that being said, this isn't a very complicated lesson, but go to your Google My Business, go to photos, right? And start putting pictures, start putting pictures and videos of yourself on your Google My Business right? Go to your website, take those stock pictures off your website immediately and take pictures of your team. You're not going to sell using stock images. If you haven't already, you need to create a YouTube channel. 
That's really important. People need to be excited before they come to your website. They need to build a relationship with you prior to coming to your website. And the best way to do it right now is through YouTube. Right? So you want to make sure you do that. At least it's the best way for me. TikTok or Instagram or Facebook may be the best for you. That's fine. For me, it's for me, it's YouTube. Right? But you need to start showing your face on your website. I can't tell you how important that is. Right? So last week I put a, a little message out there and I said, hey, I could rank you for any keyword. Uh, I'm just taking five clients. And should be signing the fifth one today. That worked out real, real well. Um, I could rank any keyword in any town. I just can. I just can't. I've been doing this long enough. And I'm not saying it to brag, but money, money back guarantee, I could rank you. So if you have a keyword that's kind of lagging and like you, you haven't been able to get in the Google 3-pack, I'll definitely be able to rank you in the Google three pack. But once you get there, you ha uh, uh, people have to know that you, ha you have a real business and that we need to show that it's you. All right. So you have to start taking some pictures and adding your pictures to your website, to your YouTube channel, your social media, your Google My Business and that whole thing. If I could help you, um, here's my text. Feel free to text me at any time. I get back to anybody who texts me. My email address is in the uh, description below. It's brettmaletta at gmail.com. And like I say in every video, the most important thing is that you take care of your family and, uh, and you kiss your wife and you kiss your kids. And that's the reason why we do this, right? This is the reason why we work so hard so we could make our families' lives easier, right? Please make sure that you pay attention to your family and you clean up around the house, and you help out around the house. All right, that's the thing that's really important. And get your picture on your website and uh, all your social, and you Google My Business. All right, guys, have a great day, and we'll see you tomorrow.